A child encounters the cats in the hat as they introduce the child to the wondrous world of Seuss. The cats begin their tales with the story of Horton the elephant who lives in the jungle of Newell. One day, Horton is enjoying his bath when he hears a voice on a speck of dust asking for help. Though puzzled, Horton delicately places the speck onto a clover. The cries for help return and this time Mr. and Mrs. Mayer reveal themselves to Horton as citizens of a tiny place called Whoville, along with the rest of the Who's. At this point, the child from the beginning becomes Jojo, their son, and is blamed for what are actually the cat's mischievous ways. Jojo is left to take his bath, but the cats lead the boy into greater adventures. The cats and Jojo are swept underwater with the fish all around in McElligot's pool. Meanwhile, Horton guards the clover and believes in the Who's despite the other animals' judgments. Horton and Jojo bond in their imaginations, and just as Jojo begins to fall asleep, the cats wake him to tell him the story of Gertrude McFuzz. Then the Wickersham brothers return to steal the clover away, and Horton chases them through the great stretches of jungles, beaches, and sand. But the monkeys hand over the clover to Vlad Vladikov, who drops the Who's into a field of clovers. Maisie reappears and asks Horton if he would reconsider sitting on her egg. Horton agrees. Finally, after 51 weeks, Maisie returns. Horton pleads with Maisie to take her egg back, but Maisie relinquishes her responsibility, and Horton tells the egg that he'll protect it and sings the egg a lullaby. Just as things seem hopeless, Gertrude McFuzz appears with the clover and the Who's intact. As Horton is reunited with the Who's, he is taken to court for talking with a speck and disturbing the peace and loitering on an egg. George Yerdel remands Horton to the new asylum and decides that the speck dust boiled in a kettle of bezel nut oil. Jojo saves the day and is honored as a thinker nonstop. Horton's egg hatches and an elephant bird emerges. As the adventure comes to an end, Jojo reappears with a cat's hat, pulls it over his eyes, ending the story with one last reprise. We hope you enjoy the show.